Hello, my name's Gemma and these are my friends Corey and Tori. Corey is Tori's big brother and they help me to tell a story. This is my friendly germ Covid and we're going to tell a story about what to do when I get lost. This story is going to hopefully help all your children out there to understand why you have to stay indoors and you can't go to school and nursery. Once upon a time there was a friendly germ named Covid. Covid was from a faraway land that no one had ever heard of before. He had been playing one day with his front family when he got lost. Corey got lost once. He chased a duck in the park and when he looked back he couldn't see his family. What did you do? said Tori. Well I stood still, said Corey. That's what my mum always tells me to do when I'm lost. If I stand still I will be easier to find again. So that's what I did. Covid is looking for his family but the harder he looks the more he is getting lost. He is travelling all across the planet. He loves children. He plays up their noses and in their lungs. Most children don't even know he is there. Covid is feeling a little bit scared being on this new planet and when he feels scared he creates a big mess. Covid is scared of the older people and the older people are scared of him. He is making a very big mess. Old people don't like mess, said Tori. No, they don't, said Corey. Old people get a bit cross with mess because it gives them too much hard work to do. Covid can cause a cough in the old people because he makes too much mess in their lungs. Covid doesn't mean to cause a mess, he just can't help it. He is going from person to person trying to find his family. The thing is, said Corey, if everyone has a cough at the same time, there is not enough doctors, nurses and medicine to help them to get better. It is like everyone going to the beach, all on the same day. The beach is a lovely place to visit and in the school holidays people go to the beach to build sandcastles and to paddle in the sea. But if everyone went to the beach at the same time, it would be very noisy and messy, with no room to play. And our sandcastles would get squashed, cried Tori. Exactly, said Corey. So in the holidays, we go to the beach over a few weeks, so that we don't all go on the same day. It is very important that people don't get a cough all at the same time. That way, there will be enough doctors and medicine for everyone who needs it. Covid is desperate to find his family, so he is moving quicker and quicker causing more and more coughs. He needs to stand still, blurted Tori. But he can't, said Corey. He is lost and frightened. Then we will stand still for him, said Tori. We can't all stand still, said Corey. People have to go to school, nursery and work. We don't have to go, said Tori. Mum says it is very important to stand still when I get lost, so that is what we will do, asserted Tori. Well, how will you get the others to do the same? asked Corey. I will wing the Queen, said Tori. Wing the Queen? questioned Corey. Yes. Dear Queen, please could you ask the whole world to stand still so that my scared friend Covid can get home and find his family. He is causing a big mess here and the old people are getting a cough. I want to be able to go to the beach and build some sandcastles but I can't because it's too busy and too noisy. Thank you, Tori. So the Queen did just that. She asked the whole world to stand still. No school, no nursery, no work. Only leave the house to buy medicine and food so that Covid can get home. Covid soon stopped moving and he got back to his faraway home where he belonged with his family. All the children went back to school and nursery and all the grown-ups went back to work. The beach was once more a lovely place to visit. There is a promise that we can all do. To get Covid home. Put your thumb in the air and say, I promise to stay at home, to not go to school or nursery so Covid won't roam. I promise to stay at home and get Covid home. The end. Thank you for listening. You children are all the superheroes that can help Covid to get home.